This week, low-cost handset manufacturer Inc. launched in India with Aircel, making both the Inc. Mini 3G and Chat 3G available across the country. Inc. added a couple exclusive features to its handsets tailored specifically to the subcontinent, like the Crick Info widget for the millions of cricket fans and added social networking site Orkut, which has a huge presence in the country. It was revealed last year that Inc. is planning Android devices, but the company is known for making low-cost mobiles. So wouldn't a full touchscreen smartphone inevitably drive up its prices? If you do a full touchscreen phone with Android, yeah, sure, you know, you go into a higher price, which is where we want to go into, we do want to do full touchscreen phones, yes, of course, so that does get into a, a higher price point. Um, but we're also extremely keen to push our mass market products out as well. And we're probably, we're going to stick with Brew with that and Brew mobile platform there because it's been very successful for us. It's a great little multitasking tool. And there we want to drive the price down and uh, at the same time uh, move with Android. So we want to keep both platforms moving. Will we see Inc. handsets on more than just Android and Qualcomm's Brew platforms? I can't see us working on Symbian. I can't see us working on Limo. I think we will watch what's happening with other stuff that's coming out. I think the Windows Mobile 7 stuff looks interesting, but my problem is, you know, I think too many uh, companies try to do hip things in $500 phones, and $500 phones aren't bought by kids. So, you know, I, I think it's interesting. Uh, it's more interesting to see what people can do for mass market, from my perspective. In a refreshing yet controversial admission, the head of Inc. acknowledges that when it comes to phones, it's very much the case of the best versus the rest. I think in the handset world, there's just two tier one manufacturers, there's Apple and Blackberry, and everything else is tier two. Everything. If you look at the hip or the in crowd or whatever in media or music in LA and New York and Shanghai and London, they've only got Blackberries and Apples, they don't pull out anything else. So, you know, and that's, that's what I would consider. They're, they're, very, they're at the top of the aspirational chain, without a doubt. So does Inc. see itself one day as tier one? I'd like to rise above those tier two manufacturers. I think that's a challenge for us. We've got to do it. There's some big names out there. Love what Samsung is doing, particularly. I think Samsung are great. I think HTC are good. But um, there's no point us being part of the, the crowd. So I want to stand out.